closer to home, new information about this spider. It has been one of the top stories on Click on Detroit all day long. The spider is poisonous and it's showing up more often in Michigan and right here in Metro Detroit. Paula Tutman traveled to Michigan State University to find out what you need to know about the brown recluse spider. So an entomologist's office is probably not the place a spider wants to be. But as you can see, they are here in Howard Russell's office at Michigan State University. He's kind of walking us through uh, what he sees as some unusual guest appearances of the brown recluse spider in our part of Michigan. While you might expect to see something with an exotic name like the brown recluse spider in a rural area like this, just outside of Gregory, Michigan, well, you don't want to get it because it'll uh, reckless spider. It'll uh, it's poisonous. It'll it'll yeah. Yeah. Do it doesn't do any good things. <laughs> <laughs> you might be surprised to know that they've popped up in hot spots like Ferndale, the campus of University of Michigan, Gregory, and Garden City. Howard Russell, who goes by the name the Bug Man, is an entomologist at Michigan State University, hence the name the Bug Man. They probably die off in a matter in a little bit of. Uh, time. They don't really reproduce outdoors. He's confirmed the presence of the brown recluse spider in parts of our viewing area, like this one from Ferndale. This is the one from University of Michigan. This one is from Gregory, not far from Chelsea, and this one from Garden City. It's a spider that has a um, bite that on some people nectarizes, which means it gets all ugly and festery. They can pack quite a bite but he doesn't believe we have a problem in this area. This is a warm weather arachnid and is probably hitching a ride from southern warmer states. These spiders that we're seeing here in Michigan didn't walk here from Tennessee or Arkansas or Missouri. They were brought here. And so they hitchhike up in suitcases, boxes, articles of commerce. I think the big takeaway here is do not panic. This is not an infestation. Just by saying infestation, I probably made people panic, right? Yeah. I, mean, I hope it's not. Maybe a migration. Migration. It's not a migration. It's not a migration. These guys, he believes, are probably hitchhikers uh, who are coming into our state. They really can't survive in our state too far north, too cold, as you know, only two seasons, winter and construction, right? But he's curious to hear from you. If you feel like you've seen one, take a picture of it. We're going to put his email address on our social media platform so you can connect directly with him so he can try to track these little buggers. Yeah, big buggers. Paula Tupman, Local 4. Kind of gives you the heebie-jeebies, right? Well, remember what Paula said, Howard Russell is interested in getting more photos, so if you think you spot a brown recluse spider, we have his contact info on Paula's Facebook page.